Hey y'all, Rochelle here, your delightful crafter, my little sidekick, Karma. Um, got a Honeybee Stamps order to share with y'all. I haven't ordered from them in a little bit, and so um, they had a sale and I went and checked it out. If you're new to my channel, welcome. I hope you stick around a spell. If you like what you see, please hit that subscribe button. Ding that bell next door if you want to get notifications of my future videos. Thumbs up, likes, always appreciated. And any questions or comments, please leave them down below. I always love Honey Bee because it's like opening Christmas presents. <laughs> um, we're going to start with this. I ordered five. Yes, five. Because um, I'm going to store them differently. Do you approve, Karma? Um, this is called bonding powder and I was planning on using this with um, like flakes like uh, gold copper silver you know like gilding flakes um, and glitter I, I, I wanted to mess around with this so I snagged the five of those um, cause it never fails when I like really like something and I go back to buy it, it's gone. And then I forget about it anyway. Yeah. The next item I picked up, um, I don't get a lot of the wax pellets because I have quite a bit of wax, but they had a new wax seal and it's a seashell. So I thought that was pretty awesome. I'll pull it out for you to take a peek at. I think the other one that I got was a B. There it is. And, it, you know, I believe wax seal stamps are pretty much universal. So, like, if you, you ordered one of these and then order, because some places you can order just the seal. And then you can enter, you know, be interchangeable. So, I got that. I guess we'll start here. Yeah, I already took a peek. Are you are you helping me, Karma? Hmm? That's garbage. So this these are two dies. And this is called layered waves. And so there's a top and a base. So the way you want to do that is, for me, I would probably, well, you could go either way. This is meant to look like, you know, waves in the water. And so you would blend in one color and then put the top die down and come in with another color. So you have like two-tone. You could possibly make it three-tone if you wanted. Um, so I got that. There's really, I don't think there's really a lot to this order. I got it, my freebie was, um, this little paper stack. Oh, here she goes. And I'm not going to open this one because I believe it's the same as another one that I got last time. There are 12 sheets, one of each design for A2 cards. Alrighty. This is called Seize the Day. S-E-A-S. -E um, it's one of my absolute favorite sayings. If you don't know what it is, you know, carpe diem. Um, but this... They're all sentiments. So thank you from the depths of my heart. Long time no see. Seize the day. Congratulations on your retirement. Uh, leave footprints and love and kindness wherever you go. Wishing you oceans of joy. He calms the storm and stills the waves. Love that. See you soon from all of us. Enjoy the waves. Let the waves hit your feet and the sand between your feet. 
your seat. Gotcha. Don't let ripples make waves. All you need is some vitamin C. Let your dreams set sail. I love you to the beach and back. <laughs> Friends are like seashells we collect along the way. You bring the sunshine and happy retirement. And all of these, all of these have dice. I thought that, you don't see that a lot. So, I'm going to put these with the right things, I guess. Okay. These two go together, but they are separate. So this is called Seaside Summer. It's a um, stamp set, obviously. Um, there's layering going on. And they send this card so that you can create that scene. And it tells you the steps um, on how to do it. So I thought that was fantastic. Sorry for that. And... Um, we have, uh, this is a cover plate and it's basically like stitch waves. So it'll coordinate with this guy. And then this last one is called shoreline scene. Oh, this is called waves pierced, pierced a two cover plate. And this is called uh, shoreline scene builder and so a lot of this will cut some of these items out but it's got extras and you can technically just die cut all of that out and have a die, cu die cut scene instead of the stamped scene and I really liked that so there you go um, I love their little thank you card because the other side, you can, uh, alcohol marker, color, pencil, you know, use, uh, stamp ink, um, watercolor. Yeah, I said that already. Anyway, I love these. Okay. Last present. And these are all little bitty things. I'm going to move this over. And I need... I'm going to use this. A little background there. So you guys can kind of see things. I have a huge weakness um, for shakers. Everybody knows that. So I got some new shaker bits. I was not going to get these. And then I was like, oh, yes, I am. Because y'all know Halloween's not my thing. But can you do a Halloween shaker card with little bones? I guess you actually need this one to see these. But they're little bones. So I got two of those. And they're called bare bones. They're clay bits. And I got some more of these. It's it's called Vintage Star. And I think it actually came out at a Christmas time. Uh, but I got them to mix into something else that I'll share with you shortly. Um, these are a repurchase. In fact, I've got some up there. I got two of these. These are called Fresh Squeezed, and I love that it has got it has grapefruit and oranges in there, and then even the leaves and lemons. It has oranges, lemons, and grapefruit. Two of those. We're almost done. Next, I got is called Aloe there instead of Hello there. Aloe, like the plant. I think it's supposed to be a spring mix. You've got flowers and stars. Um, there's leaves in here. Um, sequins. Beads. Leaves. So I got that for some springy stuff. For this, they so they have a uh, sequin mix called United. 
absolutely gorgeous and I thought it might be pretty to drop a couple of these into these you know when I'm doing the shaker card um, so that's why I got these uh, but like I said I do believe they came out with Christmas um, a year or so ago so yeah and the last is it's a new sequin mix that kind of goes with the whole beachy thing here and it's called shipwrecked and there are shells in here like shell sequins little pearls little beads and um i'm not sure what those are supposed to be that little deal there but it was a really pretty mix and so i grabbed two of those that is my honeybee stamp haul. I will be keeping an eye out. I don't... They haven't been putting out lots of stuff that was like my cup of tea. That's why I haven't ordered in a while. But y'all know I'm a sucker for the beach. So I had to grab those. So that's it. Oh, I left that out, didn't I? That's it. <laughs> um, I, I am not sure. I believe this is probably going to post on Sunday. I'm not positive. Don't forget uh, Miss Maria's um, House Mouse Stampa Rosa D stash is going on. I'll link the video down below if you want to go check it out in the description. Some of, some of the good ones are gone, but there's still tons of amazing ones left, and um, they're all in excellent condition. So again, if you want to check it out, video will be in the description. With that, I think I am done recording for the night. My medicine's kicking in, so now I'm going to start stuttering. <laughs> and um, y'all have a great rest of your day. Love y'all to pieces. Bye-bye.